and I'm Sammy and we're learning about moving closer. In this series we are looking at the different ways we can move closer and closer to loving God. Let's start our lesson. Hi. Hi Connect Kids, welcome back. Can you believe it is term two of 2021? <laughs> I can't believe how fast this year is flying. Mm. Now, I wonder if anyone remembers our memory verse for this year or what we're talking about. I'll give you a hint. It's been on the black signs every week just about this term, last term. Mm. This year, our theme is move, move closer. closer. And our verse that we've been pairing that with is from James 4 verse 8. And it says, move your heart closer and closer to God and he will come even closer to you which is an amazing verse and a promise I just absolutely love mm. but I think we're gonna be learning more about that this term aren't we Pastor Caitlin we certainly are and oh we are so excited yes. we cannot wait for this term does there any of you wish that you knew Jesus more than you do right now every day yep I know I do do you know there is always so much more we can learn about Jesus and so much more we can love about him. He is our friend. And who knows when you have a friend, you learn more and more about them the more time that you spend with them. Can you think of someone right now that you maybe are friends with that you've learned a lot about recently? And how do you learn about them? How do you become closer friends with them? Well, that is the journey we're going to go on, but with Jesus. Hmm. So we're going to talk about a few different things this term. We are going to spend a few weeks on prayer. And this is so exciting. It can sound a bit scary, but we are going to learn together how to pray, why we should pray, ways to pray, all those good things that are going to help us move closer to Jesus. We're also going to learn about reading the Bible. That can also be a little bit daunting. You know, I it's know. It's a big book. Yeah. I was talking to my son, Tobin, just the other day about all of the hard and big words that are in the Bible. And he said he finds it hard to read because of all the big words. Like Mephibosheth. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yep. Do you remember that one from last time? <laughs> yes. So we can help you with that. And we can't wait to show you some ways to read the Bible that are going to be a lot simpler for you. Mm. Ways to love the word of God, because do you know that's what the Bible is. It's God's spoken word to us. So we're going to be learning lots about that. And we're going to challenge you guys to read the Bible for yourselves. Mm. And we're also going to talk a little bit more about worship. Now we've talked about this a few times, even last year we did a series on worship, but we can never get enough of worshiping Jesus. And so we're gonna to touch on that again as well, because all of those three things are really the key to moving closer to Jesus. And that's what we wanna do, isn't it? It is, and that's not all. <gasps> Next week, we have an awesome journal mm. that we're gonna be giving each and one of you. And it's got lots of different ways that you can pray mm. and learn about prayer or read the Bible and information about the Bible and different activities for worship. In fact, it's so big that I don't think <laughs> you're going to get it all done this term. But I do think that as you work through it over maybe even over a few years, mm. it's going to help you to move closer and closer. <gasps> do I get one to too? Jesus? I guess I guess I can print you off one too, Pastor Yay. Caitlin. <laughs> so that's what the journal looks like. And right now we are going to get ready to go into connect groups really, really soon. And while this term we're learning about moving closer, we thought today would be a great opportunity in your connect groups for you to have a conversation about what do you already know? What do you already know about prayer or the Bible or worship? Mm. What questions do you have? What things don't you understand? What things do you think are a bit scary or confusing? Mm. And we'd love you to make notes of all those things and give them back to us so that we can make sure mm. as we're doing these lessons that we're helping you answer those questions, Mm. We're not teaching you, if everyone knows something, we're not teaching that again. We're teaching you new things. Mm. And we can just make sure that at the end of this term, 
we will all be able to say that we have moved closer to God. And not only have we moved closer to God, He has moved closer to us. That's which right. is the best part of this whole deal. Yes. <laughs> well, we can't wait. We hope you're excited too. And we'll see you soon. See ya. How great is this series going to be? I know, right? It's going to be so fun. Well, this is the end of our session, but, all, but as always at Connect Kids, remember to be kind, the Lord is with you, and wash your hands. Bye. Bye.